What is milliamp power? You must have come across the term milliamp power in regards to battery capacity time and time again. Whether it comes to phones or tablets or power banks. So yes, milliamp power is a term used to describe the battery capacity. So higher the milliamp power, the larger is the battery capacity. Now the term here is milliamp power. Here the H stands for hour. So in that context, milliamp power means how much power can be supplied per hour. For example, so the new iPhone 7 has a battery capacity of 1960 milliamp hours. So that means the battery of the iPhone 7 supplies 1960 milliamps of current per hour. But the iPhone runs much longer than an hour, right? This is because just so the battery capacity of the iPhone 7 is 1960 milliamps per hour, that doesn't mean that the phone consumes all 1960 milliamps at once in an hour. The phone only takes as much as power as it needs, so yes, it does depend on the usage. Then is having larger batteries always better? Yes, it is better, but again, it depends. Having larger batteries means the size of the batteries will be larger as well. This in turn makes the size of your phone or tablets thicker and heavier. And no one wants fat and heavy tech, do they? Everyone wants their tech to be as thin and light as possible. That's probably why at least till now you haven't seen any phone with more than 5000 mAh of battery. Even 5000 is stretching it. Most popular phones have pretty much lesser. That's because phone manufacturers don't want their phones to look fat and ugly. They want them to be as thin as possible. With growing technologies, companies are finding ways to increase the battery capacity while decreasing the size of the battery. So let's just hope for the best. So in the future, maybe a few years from now, we could very well expect much longer battery lives in our phones or tablets. So that's one way of going about it. Another way of going about it, what Apple is doing with the iPhone, is to reduce the overall battery consumption on the whole. For example, majority of the battery in our phones is consumed by the display. So if the battery consumption on the screen is reduced, then the battery life can be significantly improved. That's why all of the iPhones have very low resolution displays. The iPhone 7 only has a 720p display resolution that's only HD. Plus, it's an LCD screen so it consumes even lesser battery. And the new Google Pixel, though it has an AMOLED display, the display resolution is only 1080p. So this way, they save up a lot on battery. So the higher the resolution, more the battery is consumed. Then again, on the other hand, we have the Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge which has a Super AMOLED 2K display resolution. So the display consumes a lot of power, but it has a 3600 milliamp hour battery capacity, so the extra battery can easily handle the high resolution display. But at the end of the day, having a quad HD display is always better than having a HD display, so companies would want to increase the display resolution. Hence, having bigger batteries is the way to go. More is better. Hope that cleared things up. Thanks for watching, guys. If you enjoyed watching the video, do give this video a thumbs up. You can also tweet me your questions at Simple Reviews. Also subscribe to Simple Reviews to get instant access to my latest videos. And I'll see you guys next time.